Right, for an experimental COVID-19 treatment that's now underway at Ascension, Wisconsin. Fox 6's Sam Kramer tells us how recovered COVID-19 patients may be the key in helping those most at risk of fighting this disease. Fresh powder, mountain views, and time with friends and family. A late February ski trip to Austria was supposed to be a vacation well spent for Jeffrey Cleaver. Out of 15 individuals that we were in contact with, uh, 14 became positive for COVID-19. After battling a fever, cough, and loss of appetite, and Pedialyte was a lifesaver. He recovered and says all the credit goes to his primary care team and Waukesha County Health Department for providing him what he needs. Now there's hope recovered patients can help those battling COVID-19 through plasma. This is a infectious process. And one of the ways of treating infection is to target them with immune proteins or antibodies that will kill off the virus. The antibodies our immune systems develop are found in plasma, so doctors will give transfusions from recovered patients to the most vulnerable, hoping to kickstart their system and fend off the virus. We want to be able to do something more for those patients. While giving the recovered, like Cleaver, the chance to say thanks and help others reach the same outcome. For us to be able to give back for the benefit of the individuals who are in a far worse state than we would ever be, you know, it's, it's, it's simply the right thing for us to do. In Milwaukee, Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. Ascension gave its first plasma transfusion to a patient just last night, and they will continue the clinical study for at least 30 days, hoping for positive progress. Well,